Hello everyone, this is Linda. Welcome to Lenny P's Place. Hope you're all doing well today. Uh, I am, I'm at my daughter's house. It is Monday, the Monday before Thanksgiving. So, um, I got here on Friday and she and I have been having a great time. She took me to all the thrift stores, so I do have a little bit of a haul. Now, most of this stuff that I'm going to show you, it came from the Goodwill bins. And last time I had a lot of uh, good stuff that came out of there. This time, um, not so much. I found a lot of uh, clothing that I have already taken apart and took what I wanted and gotten rid of the rest. So first thing I'll show you is this beautiful lace. Um, I just cut the skirt off and kept it. Can you see how pretty that lace is? It's got all these beautiful colors in it. And I don't have any like that, so I was happy to get this. And there's plenty of that. I won't need any more of that, I don't think. So I got rid of the top part of the dress. I didn't think I needed it. And then, um, I found a pretty lacy blouse that I took the lace off of, and it is, I'm not sure if it's gonna show up as purple, but it is. It's purple and uh, white. You might see it better if I just lay it down. I'm not sure. <clears throat> I'm using my phone today, and I don't normally do that, so I apologize if uh, if it's not, Everything is not just where it should be or whatever. It's hard for me to see because I'm short. So it's hard for me to see the screen. So anyway, I got, I salvaged two pieces of that. And then I got just this small piece of lace off of a shirt that my daughter gave me that she was going to take to the thrift store. She asked me if I wanted it and I said yes. And I have plenty of white, but I wanted a little piece of it, so... Actually, it was just an insert from the shirt. So there wasn't too much more to get anyway. Then I found this brown. This was also um, the insert on a shirt, on a blouse. So it was brown or, yeah, and I don't have any of that color. It's sort of a, a golden brown. And so I put that in my cart and then I found um, a blouse that had this, let's see, this was down the front of it. I think I got it upside down. I don't know. I don't know which way it went. I don't remember. Anyway, I got two pieces, I think two or three pieces of that. Some was in the back, some was in the front. And... I got quite a bit of that, which I think is really pretty. It's an em embroidered flowers on the lace. So lots of ways to use that. And then I managed to get a little piece just plain. I got off of there and I thought that was gonna be enough. So yeah, got that. And then this was off of a blouse. And as you can see, it's not exactly a lace, but the flowers have some tulle over some of them. They've been cut out and tulle's been put behind. So I thought that was pretty. So I got some of that. And... I got some more, but there's no point in showing it because you've already saw it. And then I cut this out of a little pair of G of uh, shorts. Just I just kept the embroidery pieces. I didn't need any of the rest of it. I have lots and lots of denim, so I just kept those. And and then there was um, this. Uh, Indian style 
piece of garment or whatever that I found. And I cut all of the embroidered pieces off of that. And it's so pretty. Um, it was long. This was an insert. And this was an insert along the bottom. And so I got both of those, and then this was, this was in the middle. And I kept some of this. I got some pieces of this striped here, which I thought was kind of pretty too. Can't have too much striped fabric. It's always handy. And then there was a row of buttons, and I didn't take the buttons off because I didn't want them to get lost. So I'll take those off when I get home. It's very pretty, and then at the top, one button was missing, so they had added this uh, charm. I hope you could see it. I'm not sure. And then I found some. I'm just going to show you. I found some uh, polka dot. It's pink with black polka dots. And then I got a few sparkly things. This came off of something. Uh, uh, I think it was a blouse, and it's very sparkly piece of net. It's, it's, it's a netting, but it's so soft. It's very, very soft. And so I got a good bit of that. And then I found this, and there was a, a whole big old roll of this. So I just kept some of it because there's no way that I needed it all. I don't know if you can see it sparkling or not but it does sparkle and it's a uh, wine color I think and then I don't know what this was but it goes over something and it has pockets and it has this beautiful trim on it so I'm really not sure what it's supposed to be but I'm sure I can find a use for it so there's that, and see where am I at now? Um, oh yeah, I found one pillowcase that I thought was pretty. Love the pink and green. So got this, and. Um, oh, I found some, some nice wool fabric. This came off of a man's coat. You know, if you've ever priced wool, it's, this is like a suede. Um, if you've ever priced wool, it's very expensive. And the most economical way to get wool is to get it from mostly men's sports coats. This was a wool sweater, um, and I don't have any, um, I don't have any wool that is patterned like this. And I thought it was so pretty. So I cut that up. And then this is actually from a kilt. <laughs> That's what you call them, kilts men in Scotland wear them and it was made in Scotland and it's all this great what do they call it is it called tartan I'm not sure um, plaid and it is 100% wool and I've got a lot of that <laughs> a lot of that and they're not even my colors but um, I'm sure I'll find some use for it it'd be great for Christmas projects I guess and then, um, almost finished. A couple more things to show you. This I got off one of my daughter's blouses that she had in her pile to donate to the thrift store. So I got a little piece of that. It's a very soft um, pink fabric with little stripes in it. And, and this came off of one of her 
shirts. It's just a, a, a nice black lace. Got a few pieces of that. And then this I got for these flowers. Now this is flannel. It's off of a pajama shirt. But I needed the flowers, and I'll show you why. Um, I'm, I'm participating in um, Stitch the Seasons project that Corinne, over at To Be Loved Treasures by Corinne, is hosting. And I'm, we're just about ready to go into December now. I've gotten fall just about done. Um, so I was trying to decide what I was going to use for fall. I mean, for winter. So the first thing I thought of was kind of gray. And so I went looking for gray things. Now I found this at the thrift store. And then I went to Joann's and I got this pretty fabric with the birds on it. And, um, Let's see, I also got this gray fabric here. And then I picked up this fat quarter. I haven't even opened it up, but it's more kind of a blue color, but I do have blue in the birds and in the background of the flowers. So these are the basic colors that I'm gonna use in my winter uh, project, Stitch the Seasons Winter. So that's my, gonna be my color palette. And so I'm all ready to get started on that as soon as I get finished, I think December the, I think December the 15th or right around there somewhere close is where um, winter begins. So my project has to be finished. Um, the fall one has to be finished by then because then it's time to start the winter one. So, and I'm just making some panels. And so, yeah, that is really um, I think all that I got, I believe that is it. Oh, and then I also, I got this jelly roll just in case I needed some little pieces. And I'm not going to open it because it'll just start going everywhere if you've ever opened one of these. So it's got some gray polka dots, some, I don't know what you call that pattern, some kind of weave of some some sort. I've got some little crosses um, and then some little flower fabric and I think that's all. It's a big jelly roll but it didn't really have a lot of um, you know there's a larger a larger um, polka dot in there. I think that's it. Um, it didn't have a lot of different uh, fabrics in it. Some of them, excuse me, are just loaded. Um, I think that has little triangles. And there's, looks like there's two of each and then the bigger dots. And I think that's it. Yep. So that is my jelly roll in grays to go with my winter stitch the season project. And so, yes, that is it. So I just want to thank you all for stopping by and, and spending a few minutes with me and checking out what I found at the thrift store, even though it's not all that exciting. And, um, and I hope and wish you all a wonderful Thanksgiving for you and your families. And be safe if you're traveling. And I will see you soon. Please take care. And uh, be safe, be happy, be well, and I'll talk to you later. Bye for now.